Hi, I'm Chief Meteorologist Tony Petraka in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You've clicked on the Weather Now link. In fact, it's a good link to actually bookmark Weather Now, and we do video updates at least three times a day, regardless of whether there's a storm coming or we have nice weather. Of course, we certainly update that uh, video blog even more during approaching severe weather and storms. So, uh, Weather Now, highly recommend that uh, you bookmark that. In the meantime, you know, finishing up a, a pretty nice day. The only downside with today, um, well, the wind was rather gusty. We take a look at uh, pictures down in Newport where uh, clouds are on the increase right now. Uh, not expecting any precipitation, so uh, we'll stay uh, dry tonight. And uh, these clouds will eventually head offshore. But uh, look at the high temps today. Not bad. Pretty much where we should be for this time of year in the upper 50s to around 60. And take note. The, uh, the coastline was mild as well, and the reason why, you didn't really have the wind coming in off the water. There was no sea breeze. You had more of a land breeze. That makes all the difference in the world as far as, as, far as adding several degrees to um, the temperature along the coast. As we take a look at temperatures now, as of the uh, 7 o'clock hour, it's uh, still in the upper 50s, including 57 Providence. will eventually fall into the uh, 40s later on this evening and uh, during the overnight. See some clouds streaming in right now, but... They're dry clouds, not producing any precipitation. And an area of rain, you can see a narrow band of rain from Buffalo to just north and west of New York City. But this rain shield will actually slide just underneath us. So we get the clouds tonight, uh, but we miss that rain, and that'll head offshore. And behind that, it's clear again. And uh, that dry, clear weather uh, belongs to us for Wednesday. Really a, a beautiful day coming up for Wednesday. What's nice is that we'll have similar temperatures for Wednesday, meaning upper 50s to around 60 but not as much wind so to feel nicer here we are at seven o'clock in the evening and beyond the clouds increasing initially and then the clouds head offshore so by tomorrow morning 7 a.m we are waking up to attempts in the lower 40s mainly sunny dry very pleasant watch what happens by wednesday afternoon those low 40s jump into well the upper 50s to close to 60 much like what we had this afternoon so uh, just a gorgeous day tomorrow evening looking good tomorrow night looking at temperatures dropping back into uh, the lower 40s under mainly clear skies at around 11 o'clock so for tonight clouds on the well for tomorrow morning rather um, any clouds that we have overnight are gone by morning uh, looking at uh, less wind starting off at um, about 45 degrees and then during the afternoon hours, I mean, just a ultra nice day. These temperatures are you know, close to average what we should be or where we should be for this time of year at around 60. Uh, the wind fairly light out of the uh, north at about uh, five miles per hour. All right, we start to see some changes on Thursday. Take note, the cooler temperatures Thursday, clouds increasing. The day starts dry. I do expect by either late day or evening some mist and drizzle to move in with the approach of a warm front. The humidity will be on the increase. We'll start to see some fog Thursday night. Very humid on Friday. I don't think Friday's a washout, but there is the chance for at least some scattered showers. Now, when you bring up the humidity uh, this time of year, you tend to get fog. So starting Friday through Saturday each day, there'll be some coastal fog due to the high humidity. I think the better chance of steadier showers on Friday would come Friday night, especially Saturday. In fact, some of the uh, showers on Saturday, uh, Easter weekend, maybe heavy at times, temps in the mid-60s. And right now the plan is to uh, keep things drier on Sunday, uh, a mix of clouds and a little sunshine for Easter Sunday. Uh, you know, slight chance of a shower. I just think at this point it's a mainly dry day, not nearly as wet as a Saturday. So we're forecasting partly to mostly cloudy, mild, and dry conditions for Easter Sunday and a temperature coming in at around uh, 63 degrees. So not bad for tonight. Beautiful day for tomorrow. Weather starts to... Uh, Turn unsettled later Thursday into Friday and into Saturday. I'll have another update tonight on Eyewitness News at 10 o'clock and again at 11 o'clock on WPRI Channel 12. That's the latest. Thanks for logging in, and we'll talk to you soon.